Hello and welcome brothers and sisters from all over the internet. Today we are doing a review, but this time we are watching the teaser or trailer for season 2 of Invincible. For this series, I'm actually not up to date with the comics, uh, so I am what you would call um, animation show only. I, I don't even know. But wow, I love this show. Uh, this is a show show. Like, season 1 was amazing. That ending was something else. Outrageous grotesque um wow omni man is really the personification of black air force activity like damn he did not give a single fuck like he ran a whole train on his own son he told his son like his wife was more like a pet to him than than an actual wife it was crazy man he, yeah he was on something else yeah we were just left with so many unanswered questions in the previous season i really hope they will shine light on some of the some of the questions i have for example, like where the hell did Omni-Man fly off to after he like finished giving his son the beats? And who the hell is Battle Beast and why is he so arms my G? Like for real, he beat the shit out of Mark. Uh, Omni-Man was just watching, he didn't even intervene. Like why didn't he do that? There's no way Battle Beast is actually able to beat the shit out of Omni-Man or maybe he is, I don't even know. I hope they'll like discover or explain that situation. Also, how the hell will Mark get strong enough to protect earth he couldn't even hang with his own dad so how the hell is he gonna be able to hang with the rest of those viltrumites like for real and feel the stress building up in mark's situation i could never handle the press yeah man it's it's looking crazy for a guy it's looking mad it's looking real dark i couldn't handle that pressure for real i couldn't just thinking about all the potential chaos and madness that's gonna come it drives me crazy like I don't see how he's gonna make it out of this because I don't even know how Viltrumites get stronger if it's just by their age or if they actually have to train. Oh my god, is pressed. Oh yeah, man, god. I don't even know how the whole state of the earth is. I hope we also see that. Of course, we're gonna see that um, because Mark is from Earth. But yeah, man, if I remember correctly, they left the earth in shambles after that fight. And I don't even know how Mark's mother, Debbie, is gonna pull through uh, with the whole revelation of Omni-Man being evil. Is she still gonna be depressed? Uh, oh, I, for I forgot about Cecil, man. I forgot about Cecil. Oh, guys, Cecil. Uh, he was moving a little bit shysty. I'm not gonna lie. I'm not gonna hold you. He was... He was... Well, I don't know how I feel about that guy because he knew Omni-Man was, you know, Omni-Man. But what the hell could they have done? Like, he's Omni-Man. He... he like they couldn't kill him he's like their version of superman like there's nothing that can penetrate him pause but he actually he did all right distracting him with that big uh monster and those um cyborgs yeah and I, I don't even know what's gonna go on with him it's all up in the air right now if you ask me but yeah a couple days ago i saw amazon just released a new trailer or teaser for the second season of invincible sorry excuse me um, yeah we're just gonna watch it together uh in this video and just gonna give my thoughts and just have a little chat with you guys okay man um three two one let's go sitting in some diner or something something like that Hey, it's Steph Mark. Rogan. You're not just invincible, you're also like Earth's best food cooking man. Pretty impressive. Like... <laughs> oh, no, I I just worked here. I don't actually make the food. Um, oh, yeah, he did. Next time also, constructive criticism, do not put these green things in here. Bruh. These are green. Nobody likes pickles, yeah, for real. Um, hey, so man, did I... you ever find Urath? <laughs> yeah, of course <laughs> I found it. Uh, very, very quickly, very easily yellow skies purple grass and get this they have burgers there too Just stop like the cab stop huh? the cab no nope not even close oh. i hope they're okay i think about them quite a bit honestly your wrath man what the hell? but uh how about you what have you been up to it's been a while i think everyone agrees it's been like a little ridiculous how long it's been hey i've been busy doing what how long has well it been? i've been busy writing designing Oh. Storyboarding, voice acting, key posing, oh. in betweening, cleaning up, color slapping, comping the whole thing and all that for, you know, roughly thousands of shots, so it's kind of a lot. Sure, yeah. yeah. Although, like, 90% of that, if I'm being honest, sounds completely made up. But the real question is, when are you going back out there? 
The world needs more invincible. Oh, it's coming, okay? Hey! Yeah, I know. Bruh. Like, a specific date would be nice. Oh, okay, fine. The world will get more invincible in uh, late 2023. All right. Okay, I'll take it. Late 2023. Perfect, sure. <laughs> 2023 is that like one of your years you know our planets they all have different systems of keeping track of time oh like they go around their stars at different speeds but the way you said that number makes it sound soon is it soon i didn't actually think about that that maybe they actually have some different uh version of time depending on what planet you are um i really like that guy that that um that orange dude like he's so funny Seth Rogen, he kills it. I don't actually know if Seth Rogen is actually like a writer for the show, but man, he's so funny. Uh, I really hope we don't lose that guy. I really hope he doesn't die, uh, that orange guy. Also think Seth Rogen is actually writing for the boys. Also really great, a really great show. But <laughs> that, that trailer was something else. It was different, it was funny. So it seems like we're getting more Invincible in late 2023. So this year, later this year, we're actually getting more Invincible. That's much sooner than I thought. I didn't even realize it has been more than a year since the season ended. But yeah, man, I'm just hella excited for it. I really love Invincible. I haven't read the comics, so I'm all up for... Yeah, I'm completely open to what's gonna happen and I don't even know what to expect so i'm really excited for it yeah the guy who voices mark i think he's the guy from the walking dead uh glenn i think i actually forgot that but yeah also a very solid voice actor and i've also heard he's like really into comics so that's just great i love when series actually choose someone who actually gives a shit about the show or the comics or the whole universe of comics just like i haven't watched the witcher but i know that uh, i think his name is henry cavill uh, he's a very like big fan of the witcher and they have him as the main character so yeah i just love when they do stuff like that oh, it's called acting but sometimes the acting can feel a little bit flat and with this guy who uh, voices invincible um you can really feel that he 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 his personality isn't far-fetched for from the uh from the real guys it's, it's kind of weird but i think you know what i'm trying to say here Huh? Anyways, a really fun trailer. They're like breaking the fourth wall in this trailer and that's just really fresh and, and nice to see. Uh, yeah, I'm just looking forward for the new season of Invincible. I hope you're as excited for the new season of Invincible as I am. Yeah, man, I just wish you all a wonderful day and I'll see you in my next video. Peace.